he revives. Nine revives. Ten revives. Ha ha ha. Thanks for messing around and more Vampire Survivors Beswick. Guardian Pina is going to be hitting up Neo Galaga in Vampire Survivors Beswick 224 plus 10 is 235. Yes, I know what math means. In as many revives as possible, keep it going and get all the stats. Yeah, this would be a good time for Double Gun into Faragi. It would even be prescient what with being on Neo Galaga. But also, awful. Just awful. Why? You have a giant mob of enemies and you decide to hit the other end of the screen. That barrel is not the important thing here. Well, I have Laurel power up at least. And, well, I guess I should go grab the Armadillo. I'm down here. Good grief. Oh, there's nothing here. Empty tome, as you do. Hey, grenade, that's sadly helpful. I have other weapons. I promise I have other weapons on sealed. There we go, jeez. Didn't want to give a bloody thing, huh? It fires so slowly. In the end, we're going to see how many times I can get Peanut to revive, so we're going Awaken. And that's totally going to be the title. I didn't just make it up as I was going along, as usual. Totally premediated. Premeditated, too. Ooh. Lucky grenade there. That boss down. It'll be nice to have the other weapon. And get that weapon power up. And then just fly through the terrain with the greatest of ease. You know, I don't think I've ever actually seen the top of this building. Not that there's anything there, but hey. Well, at least when it turns into clear asteroids, it'll get a lot better. Boy, with how hard a fire it is, difficulty dealing with... Oh! Oh, no, no, you can't come up this way. You'd have to go down that way. Oh, the only spawns in out of zones. And I should probably go get that Arcana ASAP, huh? I'm gonna miss... Jeez, I don't even have my other passive yet. Oh, right, I should have waited for the level up to get that power up, but oh well. Yeah, I would have ended up with... Well, in theory, I could have ended up with two more vibes. But I wasn't going to hold out till nine minutes to start grabbing it so I can evolve it. Especially because the other weapon doesn't want to spawn in at all, apparently. There we go, geez. See you, laser. Woods hurt. And everybody's soul. I played that so many times. Try to max it out, and yet I still can't know the lyrics. Then again, I am uh, spamming the lyrics for It's a Good Day to Die inside my head every day, and I still keep things wrong. Slightly turkey signs deal with. Yeah, well, I don't need the other armadillo, but Arcana chest is along the way. Yay, out of bounds. Who cares about collision? Certainly not Guardian Pina. And Vampire Survivors, Beswick, Neo Galuga. How many times can I revive? 
How many times can Pina revive? Eleven at minimum. Obviously, it could go up even higher if I had timed it better. But what is this entire run if not? Why are you here? I get random a Vandalantian, really. Nope. No evolution for old Pina. Also, you went down really quickly. Oh, I did get close enough for you. Well, let's just sit here out of enemy range for now until the dragon shows up and I can kill it. Don't want to waste all that precious XP. Oh, wait, you're a boss. Okay, that'll get pushed down. Hey, little eggsies. The bosses don't follow normal spawning conventions, huh? I suppose it should be obvious after all that nonsense with... Da da da, them spawning and during Melisa's. Same thing with the flowers because of the random events. Oh yeah, listen to that rocking soundtrack. I think it sounds like Contra, do you? Oh man, you're just gonna get knocked back like mad. Okay, so let's knock you back down then so I can trash you out. And get my sweet, sweet evolution. Oh yeah, clear asteroids. Now they don't stand a chance. I mean, what are they supposed to do against this? Well, what am I supposed to do? I got a Molise here. And a clear asteroids going. Where did those bats come from? What? I really get bat wave random event after the Melises. Weird. Well, they come from space, so clear asteroids is prescient to destroy them all. And we will destroy them all, even if the kill count is atrocious right now. Oh my god. 10k for 10 minutes? That's terrible. 11 minutes. You know I'm gonna get better once I get some evolutions going, but still. That's bad. That's very bad. Poor Guardian Pina. Well, staying out of bounds didn't help. Come on, boss, show your face. What would be the other evolution I would even want at this point? There are other arcana I would even want at this point. I want both evolutions, of course. Oh, there's the arcana chest right in experience gem alley. I mean, I might as well just go for boogaloo, I guess. Boogaloo. Evolutions. Thanks for watching some Vampire Survivors. Boy, howdy, is that YouTube algorithm something else, huh? Explicable 900 views, and then next day, nothing. Anyone who's stuck out the grind with me, thanks for that. Treasure chest. Get that prototype C a going. Yeah, it's time for spread shotting. Hey, I finally called it spread shot initially instead of spread gun. I'm learning. I'm learning like I'm a kid again. Back in ye olden days. When TVs were in black and white. I am not kidding. Oh, they're really getting in, huh? I mean, if I focus on the direction, it's fine. Because they're a bit spicier than you'd expect. Especially considering why have I not gotten another evolution chest already. It's 15 minutes in, there should have been three, right? Heck, it should have been more since there isn't even a chest at 12 here. It's at 9 instead. There you are. Gimme.
There we go. Now I can get that pronto beam a going. Well, if you're going to give me Pierce, then I'll go random always. All right, time to get my level up storms. There we go. Much better. Wow, that was not many as I thought it would be. All right, time to just tear through the map. Guardian penis style. Oh, I'm just going to get white-handed, aren't I? Or maybe I won't take down Big Fuzz. Have you ever thought of that? Maybe I will intentionally die to Big Fuzz. Well, I don't think I can because I've tried and I still can't die. Counter was on the NES, right? Weirdly, this sounds like Genesis sound chipping. It vaguely reminds me of Sonic the Hedgehog -y music in some of its beats. Which is weird. Hey, it's a chest. What could Guardian Pina possibly get? Money? Obviously, ghosts need money. Was it Jimmy Cage? I can't even remember. I swear it was Jimmy Cage. That's Johnny Cage's brother. But like the only character who has a C in his name. Which is weird. Oh well. That's my four. They went with it's cool. I like Freeze's brother, cool. Uh. Oh, random tangents. Don't you just love random tangents that have nothing to go with on screen stuff? But hey, I'm finally overpowered. That's nice to deal with. Lots of red gems dropping, so that's good. Hey, big level of storm. It'll make it even better. Damn, between Prada Beam. And clear your ass towards nothing much is going to do that. And Prototype C is doing its best too. Hey, I'm a Dio. Bad, I don't want it. Oh, right, there's Atlanteans to kill. Should probably go do that, huh? And of course, there's Stalker. But maybe I will die before Big Fuzz. Eh, maybe there's a grenade or something. Well, there is one at the entrance to this section. What is it called? Red Falcon Hatchery? I probably... And I should have skipped it. I shouldn't have come in through the... Oh. And I grabbed it too early. Because I didn't see it on the map. Oh, right. Take down City of Lantine with the stalkers on my side. Yep. Very, very good damage here with Pina. Right now. Will I break the 100k? Not a chance. But all four Atlanteans are a possibility and wow. Stalker just does not seem as quick on the draw as he's used to be. What are you? Why are you alive? How are you alive? Atlanteans last a lot shorter amount of time than that. I caught myself. So anyway, on the Johnny Cage tangent. This should look up what his brother's name is, so that way if I stream with Casper Van Diem again, I could say something about it. Because it would be amusing. Originally, I was thinking of Casper the Friendly Ghost, but... Oh, right, I have Boogaloo. That's why the bullets got smaller. I was wondering what was happening. Like, did I imagine that? 
Just like I imagine my viewership. Oh, hey, it's Stalker again. Huh. So you get a hit marker when you get hit by the laser, even if it doesn't do anything. Good grief. Am I missing something? I, I could run away from you with Pepino now. Once I get wings. This is sad, Stalker. Did Myung dump you or something and you're, you're just lethargic? Oh, did I just get a rosary that I didn't fire? It really looked like I did. Oh, poor Stalker. Well, you're a Stalker, so what did you expect? Hey, a treasure chest. Giving candy to Pina isn't a way to win me on back, Stalker. Wait, wasn't I here with Gyorutin? I tried to break into Big Fuzz's boss arena. Wow, what a coincidence that both out-of-bounds breaking characters ended up on the same level, same stage. Well, I can kind of get in here. Kill them all. Oh well. Alright, big fuzz. I don't have your fists, so I can't punch you with yourself. Quit hitting yourself, quit hitting yourself, quit hitting yourself. Man, that would have been a good gimmick for this. Why are you shooting over there? Oh, huh. You kept my momentum from coming in, so I don't have to reposition for the laser. Nice. And I don't have to reposition at all, because you're not breaking through. How many revives do I have? Eleven? Come on, kill Pina. Give me that revive power. Oh no, I died once. I get stronger on death, right? Or is that just Lucia? Nah, uh, it might just be Lucia. Or... Uh, Sheena was the one with the blade crossbow. Lucia should have the laser, right? And there's a third one. Uh, dang it. Oh no, Mini Pina. What are you doing? Two revives. Three revives. Four revives. Five revives. Six revives. Seven revives. Eight revives. Nine revives. Ten revives. Ha ha ha. Eleven. That was the base amount. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen revives on Guardian Pina. Seventeen. No, wait, sixteen. Oh no, I lost count. Uh, seventeen. Eighteen revives. 
19 revives. 20 revives. 21 revives. Oh, what a waste of time. Ah, 21 revives. Pronto Beam does Pronto Beaming things. All right, time for Guardian Peanut to have a challenge. What challenge can occur in the Bone Zone? Who knows? I just know there's a silent old sanctuary in play. Wait, did Guardian Penis override the Contra theme? Huh. Okay, it doesn't sound like Contra at all then. Look, I wasn't allowed to have music on as a kid. Okay, at least two of them are better than none. Wow, it doesn't want to give me any weapons to start out with, huh? Well, I do not want to die, so let's get some Laurel action in. Laurel, Laurel, light the Laurel. On fire. Arg, I can't kill them all. I can barely kill a bloody thing. It's going to be so bad. Oh, seriously, is there a worse base weapon than this? You have low damage, slow attack, no pierce. Heck, I don't even think it gets any benefits from area, too. In... What benefits does it have? I'm actually struggling to think of any. Might as well just get, like, axe or something. It'd have the same effect. It'd be more consistent. It's the benefit of any Arcanas ever. In fact, our axe has many Arcanas it helps with. Also, I'm on a stage where the ability to walk through walls is literally pointless, because there are no walls. There's no terrain at all here. Well, let's get Spreadshirt up, because that'll have more bolts in play. Oh, life in the darkness. And try coming in here without any life regen. Oh, that point five is that great, but still. Yeah, I'm still not even killing these skelly boys. Clear debris is still over there being useless as all. Hell. Huh. Well, some base damage will change this around a bit. Clear a root and then punch through. Hey, an evolution. Effect lasting doesn't matter because you have an amount. Da -da -da. Do I have Guardian maxed? I do not. Well, I guess it acts sort of as a barrier. And bullets, it a very bad one. Yeah, I don't even know how you would boost it up to be useful. Like, is the number of projectiles duration based? No. I have more projectiles. So, amount. And you can't even use the beginning to enhance it, because the beginning's only three, and that's five per level, and it's still bad. Boy, is not having any pierce on spread gun issue. 
Well, at least they sort of have protective clear debris fields. Yeah, seriously. Might be the worst weapon in the game. I don't know. Just vent is pretty terrible, too. Oh, hey, chicken. Lucky chicken time. In seven minutes, uh, evolutions are going to start rolling in any ten minute now. Yep, there was my big level up, Jim. Uh-oh, I'm running out of time. I shouldn't have grabbed that red gem at all. Uh, they're less... No, no, it's the ones that... Hmm. I swear they were a lot more durable beforehand. Oh, no, it's probably because of inverse, right? Now that I'm not on inverse... Oh, no. Okay, it was only one level. As long as I try to avoid things... I should last long enough to get the boss and hopefully kill it and not spend too many limit breaks on non-evolved weapons. Oh, it's the first chest here, early evolution. I don't think I've ever tested that out. I clearly will not remember by later, but hey. Oh, right, Bone Zone's 30 minutes. Dang it. Can't afford to not limit break my evolves. Hey, maybe if I go fast enough. I shouldn't be anywhere near the ring, so I don't have to worry about the Atlantean getting in with the boss and the stalker. No rosary for old Pina here. And I do have the Laurel from Mini Guardian to protect against that nonsense right there. Okay, why are you suddenly faster? Oh boy. Well, this is going to be slow going. Oh boy, oh boy. Just barely escaped that. Whew. Okay, your speed is really random right now, stalker. Get back together with me and got a pep in your step again. This is the dumbest joke of all time. I have no choice but to take hits like that. Oh no, chest dropped. Alright, you're stuck between a million enemies, so I can actually circle around pretty clearly. I will quit. Hot chest. Well, sure, get awake now. All clear to breathe. Give me a good weapon. Probably the worst of them. Huh. Boy, am I going to need a lot of hearse on this. A weapon power up. There will only actually be two, only be two revives down from Neo Galaga. I could have gone like two or more. A stalker got banished, so that's nice. And I can get levels again. Well, I always had the ability to get levels, but I can actually... I have the desire to actually gain them again instead of avoiding them. Yes, that's the correct line of thought to go with. To go with, to go with, to go with. You know, in an attempt to sound less nasally, I tried looking up some tips for it. And like, put your tongue on the bottom of your palate the whole time. But now I just sound like this, and it looks really dumb. It's really impressive. Because it means that you're seeing my words. Like, uh, even if I rescind my tongue backwards or something, Maybe I should just talk through gritted teeth the entire time. That way my lips won't smack either. Ugh. Come on, give me some pierce. I want to pierce the heavens. With my gun. With my spread gun. Take that spread shot. There's chest yet? Jeez, it's been five minutes and no more chests. 
Did this not drop? Good. There's some pierce. There's some pierce. And there's the big red gem. Good, good. Two pierce, three pierce, in fact. It should be enough to full clear. Green. No, it does get benefit of area, but why? Four pierce is even better. Good grief. That was a lot of levels. Yep, it'll just hit the whole screen now. They can't stop me. Alright, time to fight the Atlantean. And still no chest. Huh. Then six minutes since ten. Not a single boss has shown up. That's pretty incredible. And Stalker's back. Yay! It's just what I need in my life. You were just on screen. I guess the skeletons are so fast, they make me move fast enough to knock him off screen. I can't stop, because there's too many. Or can I? Yes, I can, because can is a binary state. And I am not a troglodyte. Should I slow down? And the answer turns out to be yes, because then I can get the stalker on screen. Welp. Oh, chest at once. What? What are you playing at, game? What are you playing at? Okay, that's going to smooth things out considerably. There is life in the bone zone. These Melises have nothing on Guardian Pina. Hey, health, a nice random event. Oh, right. Uh, random level up, but amount plus one. Amount plus one. And there has to be a way to code it. Random always. Boy, I sure hope I chose random always and not random once. That would be confusing. Alright, time for the 20 minute hell march. Oh, right, I want to go kill the Atlantean. You're a boss. And you're dead. Not dead enough, it seems. Huh. Do they have a health bonus here that I didn't notice? I didn't... I don't think I read it. Yep, you got so lasered, Atlantean. You got so much laser. Huh. Why aren't you going down easier? This is odd. It's quite odd. I think I might actually be more powerful than I was fighting you on Neo Galaga. It, you're not dying as easy. Like, not even just the ones that I beat up with NFT, but any of them. Well, there's one down. And for two down. Charge to that city, Atlantean. Show him what for. As the bone zone has otherwise been conquered. 40k? Well, it could be worse. Right, your arcana chest should be spawning in soon somewhere. Wait, what hit me? How did anything hit me? I wish you go back to those chickens to get some health back then.
No, I probably should have peen read Pina's. Uh, effects page? Status page? I don't know, neither of those feel right. Character selection panel? I mean, that is correct, but it's so cumbersome. But I should do a lot of things. Like dancing. Oh, I should dance till the edge of dawn and beyond. Footloose was my autobiography. I've never even watched Footloose. I'm totally claiming it is true. Ooh, of illusions. Not really effective at 25 minutes in, but hey, what else am I going to grab? Sarah Bondi of Healing? <laughs> oh, wait, point 0.8. Isn't it point five the base? I haven't died. Well, this run I haven't died. Hey, it's a skull. How appropriate. Oh, wow, you're doing damage to me. I mean, it's not gonna matter. There's no way I'm losing, but still. That's surprising. Oh, right, duh, because Mini Guardian got turned into clear asteroids. That makes more sense. Oh, hey, Atlantean. I didn't notice you there killing me. Let me return the favor. Very slowly return the favor. Stop hitting me. I'm trying to kill this Atlantean. I need him to know that his entire city and race deserve to be sunk beneath the waves. So saith Poseidon. Oh, hey, I died again. Fascinating. All I need to do is do a beam tornado. Then it'll clear everything, and then I can refocus on the Atlantean until it's dead, and now it's dead. Now I can beam tornado forever and ever until the end of time. Clear asteroids finally gonna work out. Hey, a bunch of level ups. Boy, am I glad that Pina Random and er Beswick into this one. Beswick, 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 Wake, Beswick. I'm not pronouncing it with the A sound. Quitting time. Fifteen million, eh? Fifteen million. All right, time for a nice, relaxing trip for Neo Galaga for Guardian Pina. Clearly, there is no issue here. It would be nice to fire off your weapon, huh? Wow. Whole 18 seconds before anything got hit. Well, I need to re-roll into a weapon immediately. There we go. I can hold off. I got three revives base. Boy, howdy, though. That is some terrible, terrible weaponing. Okay. Now we got some clearance. Yeah, that figures. Well, might as well get the survivability. I suppose you could get Mini Guardian on Neo or Polis Replica too, or Laurel, or on Killableness. I mean, heck, 
find that with all Laurel. Hmm. How many levels can you get on Polis Replica? Well, there's no way I can evolve anything, but it'll still be a chest. Oh, oops. Uh, the Guardian is bad, but still, I wouldn't have selected that over a weapon at the moment. Speaking of weapon, it's time for weapon time. Ooh, rapid fire, rapid fire, Guardian Pina, rapid fire. Just a wall of death. There got shot. Ban it out. That way it'll always hit something. I want to get clear asteroids first, just get rid of clear debris, it's so bad. I will go to Guardian Pina's death stating that it is so bad. I will live forever. Hey, a chicken. That'll help. Yeah, I guess the spawns were broken and then if there was a new patch. I can't even tell. I don't say anything about updates. Oh, actually, no, I have a Discord. I could just check there. I swear it wasn't remotely as bad as this. Yeah, that was a chest, wasn't it? Uh, I don't even see the bosses anymore. It's not even like Pina's that strong. They just have no health on this stage for some reason. So you get to like talk on stuff. Oh man, because I died on Neo or Hectic Highway, I didn't talk about the shape changing or shape shifter. Because one of the shape champ. Great. Should be the one down at the bottom. And they, one of the shapes that shapeshifter turns into is a small, like, octopus based one, or a squiddy based one. Wait. Okay, it was at the bottom. I got that right. Okay, why didn't it give me clear asteroids? Or spread gun. I literally have video proof that you can pull it off the same one. Well, I kind of it is. Ugh, getting speed levels. Truly, I have reached the pinnacle of vampire survivors. But no, I have video proof that I can pull multiple evolutions that require weapon pickup off of one box. Or at least I hope that was true. I mean, it obviously is true, but if I have the video footage or not. Man, these bosses just die instantly. You can't see them. Just sheer luck if you get them or not. No. Alright, there's the loop. Oh, there's a chest before the Arcana chest. Getting real close. The arrow hasn't changed. Man, that's timely. And he just... No! Get back here! Oh, man. And now I've got so much stuff on the screen, it's actually going to be hard to check the Arcana. Alright, where are you at? Down here. Alrighty, get that awake and get Pina reviving endlessly. Oh, 
Hm. Killing death. Well, no, he can't trigger the white hand on this stage anyway, because death... Even if you kill death outside Infinite Corridor or Crimson Shroud, it doesn't trigger white hand. Probably gonna be a boss at 10 minutes. I mean, clear asteroid speed wouldn't be worse, right? It'll go around faster. Really hard to complete with Pronto Laser, though. Pronto Beam. Pronto Beam. Get Pronto and Beaming. Nope, oh, there's a boss, and it'll die by the time I get back up. Just barely made it. Just barely made it. Okay, that should be free and clear till the end of time. Man, now I'm thinking Pokemon the movie. Was it even the movie soundtrack? I mean, it was a companion to it. Wasn't it? No, I can't even remember. But all I know is that early Pokemon soundtrack existed. And there's all my level ups for the rest of the level. Stage. I think I'd remember stage instead of level. But nope. Nope. Pew pew. It's laser in time. Thanks for the chest, gold dragon. Oh, well, I got that one more or less by accident. Two chests. Two chests for Guardian Pina. Yeah, Prana Laser isn't really hitting the left hand of the screen, is it? Yep, and this is the nonsense that hit Shapeshifter. What am I supposed to do about this? They literally just spawn in on me. I don't have enough damage, you're dead. And Shapeshifter did not have enough damage. They were a weird sort of pseudo tank, no matter how much health I stacked. And then it only got worse and worse, even with, well, I don't think I was able to grab a wake. I mean, I don't think I would have been able to survive if I had grabbed a wake, but still. Wait, now they're spawning in less terribly. Did I get a random event that forced them into me both times? Because this did not happen, this in-between period. What happened? What is going on with this? Like, I know this is much more damage, but they were literally just being spawned in on me. I guess maybe I'm just doing enough off-screen? Well, I guess. Oh, that was a bunch of levels. Nice. It's weird. Sometimes things just get weird. I robot magus boss thing. I mean, if anything, it'd be more likely to be a Transformers reference. Oh no, that would be a hilarious property to have in this Transformers. <laughs> oh god. Obviously, Optimus, Megatron, Bumblebee, Starscream. Uh, probably Soundwave and Ratchet. And this is clearly bad. Okay. This isn't survivable. Um... No. Who is 
Who can survive this? What the heck is this? What was that? Yeah, that's kind of too broken. Like if Tina you know, of all characters is thinking, well, maybe you might not survive it. Who is gonna... I might have to turn off Charm and Curse for this when I come back to it. Because that's not going to be survivable for, like, anything other than the most broken characters. Well, I mean, not that... I think only one more... Maybe one or two more characters are actually going to last long enough to get to it. Hmm. Man, I'm almost done with the second wave, or third wave stipulations. Hey, Death. And I have Laurel. Oh, Pronto Beam. Oh, Pronto Beam. 452 on Neo Galaga is taken down by Guardian Peanut from the Vampire Survivor's Bezwick. 544. Is not the number to use. It's 454. Over on the Hectic Highway and back down to the Bone Zone. 453. Out of order, best order. Anyway, that leaves us with 1,478 more stage character combinations to go. Save me, fourth wave, save me. Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. Thanks to anyone who has liked, disliked, commented, or subscribed. Your support keeps me going. If you haven't, please do so. Either way, have a good day and keep messing around in the Vampire Survivor's Beswick.